Pat Love with Pat's Two Cents. Yeah, I'm still on this demonic thing. In these last days, you've got witches praying against born-again Christians, amongst everybody else for that matter. They are doing everything they can to release, to curse, everything. Now, with these demons cutting loose like they are in these last days, and you know the devil is revving up because he knows his time is running out. He's trying to take as many with him as possible. And he's going to try to wear out the saints that he knows he can't get his hand on. So we have to do spiritual warfare. You hear me? You have to be very, very careful about what you yield yourselves to. Do you know being hooked on pornography is not just something unsaved people do? Being hooked on pornography is something that born again men and women do. Teenagers taking pictures, saved teenagers taking pictures of themselves with 10 inches of boobs sticking out. It's like everything is stuck up there but the nipples. And they think it's okay. They think it's too spiritual to be modest when all they're doing is playing into the hands of the demonic realm that is infiltrating our atmosphere with spirits and demons of lust and illicit desires, strange desires. Ah. So when you are partaking in that type of activity you have opened the door wide that's why the bible says the devil walks about like a roaring lion lion seeking whom he may devour not who he wants to devour who he may devour which means those he devours has given him permission to do so because it, it may be wrong but I feel so good do you know what you feed is what becomes gigantic in your life what you feed is what becomes your strongest thing to deal with in your life you feed the desire. You flirt with the desire. You dress promiscuously. You wear your skirt up where the only thing showing is your tush. And then everything above is showing everything but the nipples. And you think that is sexy. And you wear things so tight that people can almost see your butthole. And you think that is sexy. Why are you trying to be sexy? Have you asked yourself that? Why? What is behind that? What do you get out of it? Whatever that charge is, whatever that enticement is, saints of the Most High God, I am here to inform you, newsflash, that is demonic. You are cooperating with demons when you do that. And you parents who allow your children to walk around your house half naked. You are giving place to the devil. Especially if you drink or if you are weak to pornography. I heard a father one day, I'll never forget it. He was fussing at his daughter. And I said yes because he was so right on. He said, you put something on. You don't walk around this house in underwear. You are a teenager and I may be your father, but I'm a man. You respect the fact that I'm a man. Don't forget that just because I'm your father. 
You cover that up. That was so wise. I, I respected him so much. Because a lot of you parents don't don't manage your houses. You just let them run loose like a zoo. Because you want your kids to like you. Well, guess what? What ends up happening is incest. Not just father, daughter, mother, son. Or father, son, mother, daughter. However freaky that gets. But you're also looking at brothers and sisters. I had to tell a lady one day. We were all sitting around playing. And I watched how the brother and sister were playing with the little baby. And I asked the mother. I said, do you notice how they play with her? And she said, oh yeah, they always play with her like that. She wasn't thinking anything of it. And I said, girl, stop that now. If you don't stop that. That's going to end up in incest. Now, this is what they were doing. They would kiss the little girl. And then next, next thing you know, they would stick their little tongue. And the little girl would stick her little tongue. And it looked so innocent. These are teenagers with hormones hopping. No, that's not innocent. That's creaking the door open. I don't care how innocently they're doing it. That's playing with on dangerous turf. That's warming yourself by the devil's fire. You don't play with that. You don't allow kids to be too affectionate. Because you don't realize when kids, listen, boys and girls are tickling each other. They're touching. They're catching little, little teeny weeny developing boobs. And they're getting a charge. And you think it's innocent play. You better open your eyes. Get off that doggone computer. And watch your kids. Demons are cutting loose. And you be careful how you play with your kids too. Mm -hmm. Nobody is above reproach. You have to be wise. Watchful. Very careful, definitely prayerful and discerning. God bless you. Whew.